we're going to learn a strum called the cowboy strum. Fancy that. This is the name that I learned it by, and it is down, down, up, down. The first down takes up as much time as the down up. They're one beat a piece. So you've got down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down. Get ready. Let's do a C chord and why don't you play along with me for about half a minute. Oh, one, two, here we go. Down. on one long down stroke because it sounds more finished that way than on the up stroke. If you have trouble doing this strum and putting it with the song in the next video, don't worry, just stay with the down strum. But we're going to be using the cowboy strum for other songs that we're going to learn. So it is something that you're going to want to master. Now here's something that you can consider doing a slight modification to the cowboy strum to give it a little bit more sophistication. Instead of strumming through all four strings with that first down strum, just catch the first two or the top two strings, your G and your C string. That allows that C string to ring through a little bit more. It's your lowest note, so it gives a little bit more body to that first strum. See if you can give it a try. Experiment around with it. Why don't you play along with me? Here we go. We'll do it about four or five times. One, two, here we go. Something to play along, uh, play around with as you become more familiar with using the cowboy strum and playing with this pattern and putting it with the song. Speaking of which, let's see. So, how would our introduction sound with the cowboy strum? Glad you asked. I'll show you. One, two, three. Hey, cowboy. I'll do that again so you can get a chance to figure out how it goes for yourself. One, two, and here I go. One. two complete patterns of the cowboy strum for the introduction, the first down strum of the third pattern is also part of the introduction, and then the second down strum is when you start singing. Got it? Let's do just a quick little run through. Actually, we won't be quick. We'll go really nice and slow. So grab your ukulele, make sure it's in tune, and play along with me with our new cowboy strum. We'll just do the chorus and the first verse. One, two, oh, one, two, three, four. strum, try it out with the chorus, see if you're feeling fluent with it. Once it feels like it's starting to gel, get the next video, which is going to be a play along series where we start at a nice slow tempo and gradually increase tempo so that you can test your fluency and build your speed. We'll see you in the next video.